In this problem, we're going to be looking at how we can find the equation of the tangent to the curve at a particular point. So we've got the equation y equals x cubed plus x, and we're going to try and find the equation of the tangent at x equals 1. Drop a pen. Okay, so we start off with y equals x cubed plus x, and we differentiate it in order to find the gradient function. So this will tell me the gradient, the general gradient function for all the tangents. So the 3 comes down to the front, take 1 off the power, and x differentiates to 1. So this is the gradient function. At x equals 1, the gradient, okay, notice the notation, is 3 lots of 1 squared plus 1. So you substitute x is 1 into the gradient. So 3 lots of 1 plus 1 is 4. So the equation of the tangent is y is equal to 4x plus c. So that's my equation of the tangent. Now I need to work out what the value of c is. So I need to know where it crosses the y-axis. Now I would need to substitute a point into this. But all I have is the x-coordinate of the point I'm looking for. I need the y-coordinate. How do we work out the y-coordinate? Well, this equation tells me what y is equal to. And so I must substitute it into this equation. So when x equals 1, y is equal to 1 cubed plus 1, which is 2. So this tells me that the coordinate that I'm looking at is 1, 2. So if I substitute 1, 2 into my equation of the tangent, I get 2 is equal to 4 plus c, so c must be minus 2. So y equals 4x minus 2, is my final answer. This is the equation of the tangent to the curve at x equals 1. Okay, So there's a few little things you need to do. We need to work out the first derivative, dy by dx. We need to evaluate the derivative at the point we're looking at to get us the gradient of the tangent. And then we need to find the y value for the corresponding x value. So find the coordinates that I'm looking at, which are, will allow me to then work out the constant c and the final equation.